<sighs> Mom? Yes, Elena? Can I dye my hair pink? Uh, Mom? No. Oh, Mom, why not? Princess Tiana let Dee color her hair. She has half pink and half blue, and it looks awesome. Ugh. I'm very happy for your friend Tiana. But, Mom, maybe I don't have to dye my whole hair pink. Maybe just some highlights, some streaks, or maybe my ends. Oh, that would look so cool, please. No, Elena, you're too young to color your hair. Especially pink. Are you serious? But Dee's allowed to dye her hair. So, what if Dee jumps off a bridge? Are you gonna jump off a bridge too? You never let me do anything! Oh, don't be dramatic, Elena. Come on, sweetheart. It's the weekend. Why don't you do something fun with your friends? Like what? You never let me do anything fun anyway. I don't know. Why don't you have a sleepover? <gasps> Great idea, Mom! Thanks! I'm going to my room to invite my friends. But please, please, let Peter Jr. stay away from us. I'll try. I can promise anything, but I will definitely let him know to leave you girls alone. Thanks. I can't believe Elena's already asking me for permission to dye her hair. <sighs> These teenage years are not gonna be easy. And to think, I used to complain when she was a toddler and used to break everything. <sighs> there is no comparison to the issues we have now. I gotta get back to work. <laughs> Elena's gonna have a sleepover with her friends. Hey, Mom! Elena's having a sleepover? Yeah, I gave her permission. Well, um, Peter? What? Please stay away from her friends. Don't bother them. They're teenagers and need their space. What do you mean, Mom? Look at me. I'm an angel. Does it look like I would ever do anything to bother my sister? I love Elena. <laughs> because I know you. I'm telling you. Don't bother your sister or you'll be in big trouble, you understand? Oh, okay, mom. I'm gonna switch it up and send them an email. Okay, sleepover. Sleepover at my house tonight. What do you think? All right, hope you can come. And let's send this to Annabella, Serena, and D. And e oh no no no! Oh my goodness! I almost sent it to Emma. Oh no way! All right, send. Thankfully, Mom made me clean my room, and now everything is ready for tonight. <sighs> let's see what can we do. Hey! Ah! Why are you sneaking up on me in my room? Didn't you see the sign that says, Peter, do not come in. Give me my privacy. Ugh. Are you inviting Serena to your sleepover? Yeah, why? Oh, I just think she's so cute. Ew, Peter, stop. She's way too old for you anyway. And she's my best friend. And I'm begging you, when my friends are here, stay away from us. Don't bother us, you got it? It's not fair. I can't have a sleepover because you have a sleepover today. Duh, why would mom let you have a sleepover when I'm having one? We don't need your friends bugging me. Alright, get out of here, bye-bye. We're gonna have so much fun. Mm-hmm. Hi, girls, welcome. Hi, auntie. Hi, Miss Elsa. Hello, Miss Elsa. My mama brought some gumbo for you. Oh, Tiana's such a sweetheart. Well, she's been promising me some gumbo for like three weeks now. Thank you so much. You guys can just go ahead up to Elena's room. You know she takes forever to come down. Have fun and stay out of trouble, girls. <laughs> Dee, I love your pajamas. Aren't they the cutest? Girls, thanks for coming. Of course, duh. <laughs> Do you guys remember when we were little? We had so many sleepovers. But Dee wasn't part of them because she was still living in Louisiana. I know, I missed out on all the fun. What did we used to do anyway? Do you guys remember the last sleepover we had on my magic boat? Oh yeah, that was so fun. Back then, life was so simple. Being kids. I remember we were like obsessed with Snapchat. We used to play with all the filters. Yeah, I remember that was so funny. I mean, how did you have a cell phone so young, Serena? 
I don't know, my mom was kind of always spoiling me or something. Ugh, oh, those good old days when we had no worries in the world. Yeah, and we had no pimples or acne or anything. The good old days where all we did was play with dolls and make ourselves look funny in different filters. <laughs> well, the puppy filter was definitely my favorite. Yeah, mine too. But my mom still treats me like a kid. I asked her if I could dye my hair pink and she said no. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. My mom told me I could dye my hair. I kind of wanted to get blue highlights. Oh, it's not fair. I have the most strict parent ever. It's not so bad. I don't think I'm going to dye my hair anyway. I don't know if I will look good in blue. <gasps> Serena, your bracelet. It's beautiful. Thanks. I got it under the sea from my grandpa during summer break. All right, girls. I want to show you something I learned on the internet. After having the magic class in school, I said I need to figure something out. It was so interesting. Take a look. Whoa! Whoa! Since when did you become half witch? Oh, girls, magic is so fun. I can't wait for the class to start again. Girls, how about we go downstairs? My room's a little bit small and we can listen to music, watch some TV, paint our nails. I don't know. Yeah. I was looking at my Instagram comments and everybody's saying that I need a makeover. I mean, why can't people just like me for the way that I am? I like my curly hair. I think you're beautiful. You don't need to change a thing. I agree, honey. If you're happy, don't change a thing. Thanks, guys. I have the popcorn here. Our favorite song's about to come on. I love this band. <laughs> me too. Cause Serena, cause Serena, it's your birthday. Guys, the band is coming to our town next week for a concert. Great. It's not like my mom's gonna let me go anyway. We have to go. We have to figure something out. Uh-uh, we cannot miss this concert, Elena. I gotta come up with something to scare them. I can't let them have a fun sleepover. <laughs> what will I do? Guys, I was thinking I wanted to open up my own YouTube channel. What do you think? But the people are so mean through the comments. They're gonna tell you that your hands are weird, that your eyes are crooked, that your hair is dry? I don't think so, Elena. Elena, I think you'll be just fine. These people that write mean comments are just haters and they're hiding behind a computer screen. Don't pay them no mind. Yeah, and you can have me and my guitar. I can definitely perform in your channel. Yeah, I gotta think about that. I got the new nail polish collection. Who wants to try it? Oh, I do. <gasps> this color is beautiful, D thinks. <sighs> I really like this pink one. Thanks, D. I'm getting hot and hungry. Um, you guys want to order pizza? Duh. Okay, guys, so I brought the best face mask ever. It's made out of seaweed, and all the mermaids use it. That's why they're always glowing, and their skin is so perfect. Want to try? I could definitely use some of this. My face is so dry. Me too. I'm like breaking out everywhere. But let's do it before the pizza comes. Okay, you're almost done. Um, Serena, why does this smell so disgusting? Because it's like from seaweed and other fish eggs and stuff. I don't know. But I promise you, once you wash it off, your pores and your skin will thank you forever. Who's next? Um, I think I'm gonna pass. Yeah, me too. It looks like an allergic reaction. The food is here. Um, Elena, you can't open the door like that. You look crazy. Oh, no, no, no. We always have the same delivery guy. I think he's gonna think it's hilarious. Or maybe even get scared a little bit. <laughs> You'll see. He's totally cool. <laughs> Let's see what he thinks. Pizza delivery. <gasps> it's Justin. Oh, no. Poor Elena. This can't, this, can't this can't be happening, this can't be happening, this can't be happening, this can't be happening. You're not my usual delivery guy. I know, I'm covering his shift. I just started working here. You go to Royal High, right? Um, yeah, we are locker neighbors. Um, <laughs> right. Anyway, green looks good on you. 
All right, I'm out of here. Enjoy. Bye. I can't believe this. <laughs> Elaine, are y'all right? These things only happen to me. Seriously? Hey, watch out for the pizza. Love the pizza. <laughs> oh, Elena, you have to wash off the mask before your face remains permanently green. What? Serena, what are you... Don't bring these kind of masks here. <sighs> okay. This was too much for me, all in the last 15 minutes. But he totally complimented you. He said you look good in green. <laughs> <laughs> now when you go back to school, you guys will have something to talk about. Are you guys serious? Okay, Jeffrey, you did it once, you can do it again. I don't know why, but girls hate bugs. And you're a bug, so you're about to scare them. <laughs> I'm sorry, Serena. I have to do it. Okay, guys, I have the best plan for next weekend. You ready to hear it? I already told you my mom won't let me go to that concert. We don't have to tell her. Go, Mr. Beetle, go. Okay, we can't say we're having another sleepover because that would be weird. But we let them think we're at the mall, we change our clothes, then after the concert, we go back to the mall and that's where they pick us up from. It's pretty genius, they'll never know. How did you come up with such great ideas? I'm sorry, my lovely Serena, but you're the first victim. We can't miss this concert. All of Royal High will be there, guys. Like, seriously. Wow, something tickled me. Ew, it's a huge bug. It's a huge bug. <laughs> oh, no, it's crawling into our pizza. <laughs> get it out. Don't worry, guys. I'll get him. Ha! It's all good, guys. I got him. Thank you, Annabella. Thank you. Thank you. I'm not scared of bugs. My little brother and sister always bring them around. Oh, no! What did you guys do? Oh, Mr. Jeffrey, you killed Mr. Jeffrey. You squashed him like a bug. Well, you should have never brought your bug anyway. I'm sorry, Peter. It wasn't my intention. I just wanted him to be covered so the girls wouldn't freak out. Why would you bring that disgusting cockroach here anyway? Yeah, it's so gross, Peter. It's not a cockroach, it's a beetle, guys. And it belongs to my science class. And now it was my turn to take care of him. Oh. Mom! You guys can come down now. The beetle is dead. I'm sorry, Mr. Jeffrey, I failed you. I had one job, one job. The other kids in class are gonna kill me when they find out about this. What is going on? Why are you guys screaming? Annabella killed Mr. Jeffrey. I'm sorry, Auntie Elsa, it was an accident. I didn't mean to. I just wanted to cover him, but I accidentally killed him. Is this Mr. Jeffrey from school? Yeah, Peter tried to scare us, and that's what happened. It wasn't enough. He used it on me the first day of school, and the yucky bug bit me, and I had a huge pimple. But he tried to ruin my sleepover, Mom. Elena, be more sensitive to your brother. Peter, that means you're going to fail your class now. I'm only going to do this one time, and one time only, you understand? <sighs> I can't believe this. What? Now put him back in his cage right now. And everybody, please go to bed. It is very late and you're screaming. <sighs> Mr. Jeffrey, I'm so happy you're alive. Oh, the kids at school will forgive me. Good night, bug killers. Um, bye, Serena. <clears throat> Mrs. Elsa's powers are just amazing. Oh, I'm glad he's okay. I felt really bad about killing Mr. Jeffrey. Whatever, but let's get to bed before my mom freaks out on us. Next time you guys want to have a sleepover and not sleep, let's do it at Annabella's house. Auntie Anna is really cool. <sighs> I'm getting tired anyways. Well guys, we really hope you enjoyed this video. And don't forget to give it a thumbs up if you want to see episode 4. And we are going to try to attempt to go to the concert without our parents knowing. But Elena, I have permission to go. Ugh, whatever. Thank you so much for watching. See you guys next time. Bye!